Yo, before the removal of the jewel arena, I had a series called In Debt for a Pet, a RuneScape series where I would stake my whole bank whenever I got a pet. I messed about with this series on and off for the last five years, and this account was the one that started it all. I maxed the account in 2017 and started playing other accounts after doing so. Fast forward to today, and as you can see, I have a few accounts, but none of them feel completed. And that's something I'd like to change. My favorite RuneScape content to watch and interact with is completionist content. Whether it's Hey Jace filling up collection log slots after achieving 200 million XP in every skill. <gasps> Oh my god! Tasty pouring blood, sweat, and tears into grueling combat challenges. Or flicking through the Twitter timeline to see Iron Man completionist content from my favorite shit posters. I'm going to start working on completionist content on this account. Welcome to Completionism, the RuneScape series where I fill in collection log slots and attempt the hardest tasks of the combat diary. Good evening. We are going to take Zuck for a walk. Your boy gambled his last Inferno cape because I didn't think I'd be playing this account anytime soon. I don't usually play full screen in HD, but I figured that I would do a chill Inferno run to get my Inferno cape back on this account and also to get some nice scenes from the Inferno when I inevitably do the combat diary achievements for the Inferno. Hey, nicely done. I don't think I'll get any combat achievements here, but I've got my cape back and that's what matters. We start this series off maxed with a one bill cash stack, very little collection log slots filled in and almost none of the combat achievements done. To do these combat achievement tasks without a massive cash stack, so it's time to make some money. One bill GP is simply not enough. Many of these combat tasks are excruciatingly difficult. We're kicking off the money making adventure with a twisted bow and a bingo board. Today marks my clan's fourth bingo event, the Scuff Bingo 2022. I figured this would be a great way to make GP in game as I'll be able to stay motivated to do so throughout. There are 42 games is competing three teams of 14 i am captain of one of those three teams we are the sophonym stellar sippers and we will be competing against the brimhaven boss driver and the wilderness wibbly woos the rules are simple each team of 14 has seven days to complete the board Points will be awarded to teams for completing each tile. The first team to complete a tile receives three points, a gold medal. Second receives two points, a silver medal. And the third team will receive one point, a bronze medal. All right, we're underway. I've preloaded a gauntlet chest in hopes of getting a PVM pet early on. No. We had 10 of our 14 players online, so we decided to go for the 20 Tazar points tile. A fire cape counts as one Tazar point, and an inferno cape claim counts as three Tazar points. We had 10 players, so all we had to do was get two fire capes each, before any of the other teams did. I didn't bring a stam, fuck my life. Ah, this isn't looking good. The Wilderness Wibbly Woos had exactly the same plan as us, but they have 11 players online. So we're essentially relying on them to mess up and die and none of our team members to die. We have shut them. We're finished. Congratulations, Jane. All right, well, we've gone for gold with the Tazar points task, but we are gonna have to settle with silver. The other team have more players online, so they got it before us. Well, as things stand, the Wilderness Wibbly Woos are first and have three points. We are second with two points, and no one really knows what the Brimhaven bus drivers are up to. This isn't good. We've taken a fat L early on on the Tazar points. We still have a lot of players online though, so we're gonna try and do the 250 Temporos KC in a couple of hours. Load those cannons! Me when my internet's slow and I'm trying to look at porn. <laughs> Tiny Tempor obtained by a Wilderness Wibbly Woo member, but it doesn't count because it's on the list of banned pets as you could have th theoretically saved up some Temporos points before doing the activity. Wow, I got a fish barrel. Okay, we were beaten to the punch by Wilderness Wibbly Woos again. They saw that we were doing Temporos. Someone must have leaked it somehow because we tried to keep it under wraps. They came after us. They have 13 players online. We have nine, so... They beat us and now we have two silver medals and they have two golds. As things stand, we are currently second, but only by a point. Brimhaven bus drivers decided to get the Zalcano tile done first off the bat, which is a really horrible tile to do, so props to them. Uh, they're probably going to catch up to us and it looks like we're going to slip into last very soon. Okay, we've gone for a risky tile. We're going to go for the complete a corp shield. We need to get a spirit shield, an elixir and a sigil to complete the corp shield and get gold in the tile. No one else is going for this. We keep getting sniped on the player mass tasks. So this one's down to RNG. Hopefully they can't follow us and get it before us. 
our first corporeal beast trip was unsuccessful we literally just sat there and watched other teams get items all right it's half three in the morning my team have gone to bed i'm doing some vorkath as there's a 1000 vorkath kill completion tile to do having a look at the master and grandmaster achievements for vorkath they look really fun to do be looking forward to getting these done after the bingo i've just woken up um albeit very late like 2 p.m my time and they've gone and finished the whole vorkath tile already what the hell This place is actually pretty groomy. Good afternoon. Today is a new day. My team sucks. Quite frankly, we're so far behind, but we might be able to catch up. We have quite a few players online, so we're going to go for the Herbie tile, the Hunter tile, and hopefully the Skilling pet tile. It'd be really cool if we could get a Herbie pet here. That means we could potentially knock out three gold medals and have a chance at competing in this bingo once more. Our bingo is absolutely mudded. We've been beaten to 20 Tazar points, 250 Temporus KC, and now 1,000 Vorkav KC. The only chance we have left to clamber a gold is to beat the Wilderness Wibbly Woo to 1,500 Herbie. I don't care. Oh, grow up. That is a skilling pet for Wilderness Wibbly Woos. Not good for us. What? That's a silver for the Brimhaven bus drivers. They both got the Herbie pet within six minutes of each other. That's unreal. What's going on? A whole clan has just got one skilling pet each within like nine minutes. Well, the inevitable's happened. We've got silver in Herbie, bronze in skilling pet, and we're probably going to get silver in Hunter. The Wilderness Wibbly Woos have five gold medals. At three points apiece, they are currently first with 15 points. The Brimhaven bus drivers have two golds and a silver. They have eight points. And in last place is the Sophonem Stellar Sippers, who were basically sniped for every opportunity. <laughs> The Wibbly Woos are eating. It's time to smith. We're going to try and get this gold before them. This was a gold medal that we successfully achieved. Selfishly, I wasn't too happy about it because smithing is a gold sink. I'm not making any GP doing this, and I wanted to make GP for my series. I think it's time to go back to Corp. Ah, the sweet sound of nine thralls slapping a cum barrage on Corp's face. We've just received a holy elixir, so now it's just a sigil to go, and we can claim ourselves a gold tile. Calamari rings. But they're like, um, they're not like fried or battered, they're like, um, wow, I just got a jar of spirits. That's actually a bingo tile, but unfortunately we were third to it. Uh, the other teams got theirs from Cerberus, so not the best, but we got it. Yes. Yes. Thank fuck. We've managed to get another gold today out of the blue. We got a PVM pet, so we have smithing and a PVM pet now, but we're still really far behind the wilderness wibbly woos. Yo, GM gamers, I would show you the bingo standings, but they're pretty much irrelevant to me at the moment because we are dead last. We're going for bronze medals at the moment because they're easier to get and we're not having any good RNG at any of the bosses that we're doing as a team. We're currently being carried by an Iron Man that can't even do corp with us, but he got a Kraken pet last night, so that's great for him. <laughs> <clears throat> and L Lorraine, I was... I was Let's go! Oh, oh my, my god, god, no way. Show me your cock. I don't know if this was like a big brain tactic by the other team, but they started going for the dragon pickaxe from each three wilderness bosses at peak time. It's like 8pm, which is the worst time to do it. We thought we would give them a taste of their own medicine by following them and trying to snipe it from them, but it's not worked out for us, and now they've completed that tile and we're just gonna give up and go back to corp soften him silver sippers bruv <laughs> i've not checked the standings because i don't want to know we're down bad uh, horrendously bad so we're going to try and get a sigil from corp at some point in the bingo and hope we just have fun and make money oh no they're doing corp oh god damn it. i swear they get a sigil it's gonna happen isn't it yeah 100%. sad it's the end of day two. Our board is looking very silver. The Wilderness Wibbly Woos board is looking very gold. And the bus driver's board is looking very full. 
Mate, change my neck. The weather is perfect. I'm sitting here in my change in my, my, in, my tra- in my track suit, like with no, my no. big fuck off like loafers on. Like my feet are like nice and warm. Have a cup of coffee, ate a pizza, killing vodka, talking to the boys. Maybe have a wank. Yo, GM, it's day three or day four. Don't know, don't really care. But at this point of the bingo, I we're trying to sweep up some bronze medals. So I'm going to go mining um, until a corp team comes on and then we can all go back to corp together and get absolutely nothing. There's no way. <laughs> Just got in, got that. <laughs> but that's not even a real screenshot. Oh, my team's just royally fucked at this point. Like, that. They are. Uh, so, we did 1,200 corp kills and got no sigil. Which, to be honest, isn't even that unlucky yet. But they've, they've gone and killed 105 and gotten an arcane. What the hell? If you saw the board earlier on in the video, you would have noticed there were four question marks hovering over four tiles. These are extra tiles that were released halfway through the bingo. Let's see if we can get some done before the other teams. Why are they beep beeping? They've just gone and got a dragon chain body before us, haven't they? We're not gonna, go, we don't have enough people to do the God Wars tile. This was the only chance we had. Well, I guess we're going for silver. Wow, my series about completionism is actually coming true. I have done a diary. Okay, we couldn't even get silver in this and we started doing the D chain grind before the other two teams. We're not even going to settle for bronze. I think we're going to go back to corp at this point, but we don't have enough people on, so I will try and get an enhanced weapon seed. Yeah. That's big. <laughs> oh, 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 no, 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 as far as i'm aware they were hunting for an elixir to get the silver in the corp tile so yeah i'm mad salty man but congrats on getting two arcanes i guess brimhaven bus drivers stormed the next and gwd tiles so they are first wilderness wibbly was second and we are third Good morning, it's currently almost 2am. We're down on numbers pretty bad today. People have lives, they've gone outside. Here's us though, still grinding corp. We've uh, we've had to get some outside help to even muster up a team today. There's only four of us. We've invited the web developer of the Scuff Unit clan to come and help us. Shouts to Belgium for making the website. It's been very interactive and easy for me to make content over, so thanks mate. If he gets a sigil, it doesn't count, so we have to make sure he doesn't get much damage he can't afford carols so he's in void bits us but we'll see what we can do mm, the wilderness wibbly woos have just claimed their pvm pet which is a silver we got the gold when we got our kraken earlier i guess this means we have absolutely no chance now of winning this thing <gasps> there's no way there's no way dude F off it doesn't count for anything. I'll take the money. 37 mils, fantastic. This does not count towards our bingo tile, though. It's the one tile we've been trying to complete for the whole week, and we just can't do it. Hopefully, Belgium can afford some house tabs now. <laughs> we just told him to leave because we don't want him to get another signal and not count. And he's gone to Kraken and he's just got on a pet. Oh, die. Yeah, it's one in a thousand, and I think a, a sigil is one in five eight five, and I've had two. Oh my god, I got another jar of spirits. You're trolling, that's my third one today. It's one in a thousand. It's been almost four days straight of us grinding corporeal beasts. We've amassed over 2,000 kills now. Um, the bingo is like so far beyond our reach. It looks like the Bim Bim Baven bus drivers have um, taken the lead with 48 points. 
Wilderness Weary Wee is at 40 and we're third with 17. Some interesting news though, there's uh, the final EHB tile, which is like efficient hours bossed. We probably will win that. And also we are going to win the Sepulchre speedrun because we have Drainth and he's a gamer god. Got, we got the best one. We got the best one. Oh my god, it's over. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry if I woke you up. Holy shit. I can't believe this, man. It's 2.30 in the morning. It's the last day of bingo. And we got it. Got, got an Ellie. Huge drop. Back to back. Never lucky. Six man team. 3 a.m. We got it on the last day of the bingo. Let's go. 147 mil split each. The Scuff Unit Bingo 2022 has ended and the victors are the Brimhaven bus drivers. It was such a close call between them and Wilderness Wibbly Woos. We were always going to be dead last with the amount of bad RNG that we had. I went to the Corrupted Gauntlet straight after the bingo and I managed to snag an enhanced weapon seed on my laptop. I didn't even have my mic turned on sadly, but I'm going to start now sinking all of that GP into gear to do the combat achievement diaries. I think a good place to start will be the Corrupted Gauntlet. I want to corrupt this bow. I'll need 2000 shards and that will give me a good chance to get the speed run done as that is the only Grandmaster task I have to do for the Gauntlet. My goal this video was to amass some GP and I feel like I've done that pretty well. It took a while for us to make some but we finally did it with an Elysian Sigil split. I cannot wait to get this series underway properly. This is going to be a huge test of my gaming abilities when it comes to old school RuneScape. If you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing and make sure to check out my group hardcore Iron Man series as well. Thanks guys, take care and I'll see you soon.